Hi guys, hey here guys. he is, and we're gonna tell you what it is that we've been um, keeping a secret. What is it? <gasps> what is it? What is it? Oh, we we sold our house. We sold our house. Oh, I know you guys. Is. Some of you are probably wondering, did y'all just buy your house one year ago? Because <laughs> I remember us talking casually about it, and people, right, at some point. Yeah before and people were like you guys are oh when we, were, we showed videos of us house hunting that one time oh, and they're yeah. like didn't you guys just buy a house well yes we bought yes. our house last year and we just sold it because like we mentioned before it was a starter home guys yep. and it just so happens that we were in a situation where we could sell so now we're actually house shopping we're house shopping right now yeah, yeah to get into something a little bit more spacious for our family <laughs> so that's been the big surprise it's a big surprise. We uh, we didn't want to announce it until it was done. Yeah. So it's just one of those things. Like, it wasn't. I don't know. It's not it was a good experience. Yeah, it was a great experience. Very. Yeah, it was a great experience. We the have, realtor was great. Yeah, we have a really great realtor. Yeah. Awesome. And that made everything. It made the whole process go by so smoothly. So now we can officially say we've bought a house and we've sold a house. Yeah. How cool is and we're that? Gonna buy another house. And we're gonna buy another house. How cool is that? That's very cool. That's, That's very, very cool. cool. Yeah. This so was excited. a dream. This was a dream. We did. We had the dream to buy our house and to possibly sell it because we. It was a starter home, and if you, for those of you who live in Canada, especially in the Toronto area, yeah, you guys, guys all know the yeah, story. You know how where hard it is. And what we're all going through. Yeah. So when we bought our first home we were buying within what we got qualified for and you have to buy within your means you can't go outside of that so that's what we did but unfortunately the house was on the smaller side I mean it was still a three bedroom with I don't know the necessities three bedroom two baths and a kitchen and that was you know it was it was okay it's a good but start home. it was a great starter home we could have still lived in it for another year if we really wanted to yeah but but just the way the market is going, um, yeah, we feel like it's better we don't wait until next year because um, it's just it's just crazy here. It's just crazy. If you guys ever look up affordability index and you look at Canada, uh, you'll see just how crazy houses are right now in terms of relative to people's income because you know you got to be got to be lucky or pretty well off or you got to do a lot of saving or you got to do some number crunching to get a house to get exactly so anywhere like within the 150 kilometers of Toronto yeah so it's been it's been a great experience we've been very fortunate to have been able to buy a house and I explained this to you guys before I made a little mini video a while back talking about it but it's been a blessing to actually be able to do what we wanted to do that's how God good God is guys like we you know we try to do our part but we also pray and we just yeah. have faith and it's easy to get discouraged in a market that's like this like when you can't buy something because we wanted to buy and for a long time we thought this was never gonna happen and even last year when we bought like we yeah. were at the point where we were discouraged and we were like oh gosh this is not this is something that's not yeah it's not gonna happen for us because we just couldn't really afford a lot from what we were seeing no yeah but you know with just being positive and just just keeping you know like I said being praying and just being thankful for what you have in the moment too don't overlook that like if you have a place to stay you've got a roof over your head and all those things too just be thankful in the process because that's a part of it you don't want to just be ungrateful so that that's right. you know that's we, right we remained positive and we actually got a house and that was pretty cool and then we were like maybe in the next year we can sell but then we learned that that perhaps wasn't going to be so easy because there whoa whoa was that too much of a glow because um there are fees and stuff involved yeah and it, by the time you take them out it may not be beneficial to sell because there's not like you're not really gaining anything you're actually probably going to lose right yeah it's very possible you have to wait you know generally you have to wait a while to build equity to enough build yeah to to sell because i mean you got to pay real estate you got to pay real realtor fees yeah 
so things can get pretty expensive and 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 clo and closing costs and closing costs. various little and yeah. uh lawyer fees and stuff so it yeah it's a lot and anyways like long story short it, it worked out for us and we are so thankful, yeah, thankful. so so thankful yeah. like god is so good god is good and yeah. i just want to we just want to share that with you guys um it's a big step it's a big step and we just so, want to encourage you guys right we're a young family and like you know you guys have seen that we've kind of lived life backwards in a sense and you know but we just want to want to share with you that it is possible even if it's hard initially just you know do what you have to do like be optimistic pray save yeah. be smart be, yeah be yeah you know that's right and um and you'll get there and even look in your communities i know of certain communities that do have stuff where i guess they maybe help people build houses i don't know about that because we we didn't do that like we saved our own money and all that stuff and did this on our own but i i do know like from certain advertisements and stuff i've seen there are right there are building programs and stuff i think that helps people Oh yeah. Uh, help oh, yeah. people build a home. So it's it's kind of like do your research too. Do your research because maybe there are things around you that could help you buy a home. Um, like I said, we didn't do that. We saved Ontario, our money. Ontario is, yeah. But but anyway, that's a, that's what we wanted to tell you guys. We just wanted to share the news. Share the news, and uh, if you if you're surprised that we're in a different home in the next <laughs> couple months, well, we actually want to take you house hunting with us. We'll take yeah, we house, should. Yeah, we should. Yeah, take we'll you take you house hunting. hunting with us. With us, we've been looking at a few stuff. So, yeah. but we're just being patient and trying to find the right one. Um, also, what was I gonna say? Uh, the right community also makes a big difference, right? Yeah. So we got to find the right house in the right community. Yeah, and I, oh, I wanted to share with you guys the big news. We actually sold our house in like a day and a half, guys. One day and a half. Yeah. We put our less house less than forty-eight hours. Less than forty-eight hours. That's Isn't how that hot the market is here. That's crazy. Less than forty-eight hours. Crazy. And it was sold. Yeah, we put our house up. So in between all the mix, we didn't tell you, we didn't show you guys, but we were um, kind of prepping our house. It wasn't too much. Sta there wasn't any staging. We staged it with our own furniture in a sense. We just kind of decluttered. So there are times when you know, you know um, you guys weren't seeing a lot of vlogs and stuff. That's a part of what was taking place. It was just really yeah, busy. Yeah, just busy packing up a lot of our stuff and getting it out of out of the way so the possible buyers could come and actually see our our house for what it is and maybe have a vision of their own because when you do have your things kind of cluttering it up it's hard for them to envision their stuff in there right yeah. so we just had to kind of eliminate the clutter not that it was junky and clutterish junky, but let me just try to make it show well just for it to show well so that was a big part of the process and that's a part of why you guys weren't seeing a lot of vlogs and stuff because we were just busy yeah and then <laughs> and then once once it went up in the afternoon um we were out of the house for the next four, yeah yeah we were out of the house for the for the next that, that day, day one full the, day and, and full half day a after. day yeah so yeah, we had to take our dogs with us. It was just... Because you uh, need to make it, you know, there are a lot of showings and people wanted to come through and we wanted to make it just yeah. easy for them to come through it without any hassles. So that, you know, that was... That those were like long days, but they were so worth it. Like when people called to, sh when agents called to to do a showing, we were just like, yeah, like it's okay, even yeah, though, yeah. even though it was, you know, it's it's not It'll always gonna be easy. Yeah, it took up the whole, like it was the whole day, nine to nine, like nine to nine, literally. Nine to nine, yeah. But it's all worth it because you know what it's for and you know what it's going to do in the end. So that was, it was yeah, awesome. It was, it, was awesome. it was just like, was awesome. I couldn't imagine be like, oh no, not today. And then this, the showing thing would have to go on endlessly for a whole week. And then our house probably yeah. wouldn't get sold for two weeks. Right? Yeah. Cause who knows? Know, yeah, who knows, right? But... And now next week we're gonna start house hunting, um, and uh, in this market we got to be ready to buy. ASAP. As soon as we something find something we want, boom, boom, we're just gonna put an offer in. And yeah, sooner than later, guys, you're gonna see us. We'll be in a new, a new house. Like a, you know, it will be pretty cool. So. Um, Thank you guys for constantly supporting us. Yeah, for Thank support. you for those of you who are newly subscribing to our channel, though we haven't been posting um, daily like we planned on it, because that was the vow for 2016. But y'all know there are some exceptions. That's an exception right there, right? That was yeah. like real life problems. That's Prepping right. your house for sale, I know you can understand. So 
thank you guys so much for understanding and for watching and for supporting um we love you guys yeah ciao don't forget to oh actually i can't say it mick's gonna say it right now go ahead mick take it away hi guys thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to join the tribe subscribe subscribe <laughs> it's the era you are the era